How do squids move around? You know, for a long time, I thought I knew the answer, but it turns out I was wrong. To show you guys what I learned and to answer this question, I brought out a specimen for us to look at. We have a nice squid in a jar. We're gonna crack it open and take a closer look. Take off the top, little glass top right here, put it to the side, use these tweezers to carefully pull it out of the ethanol. This thing is gonna be super, super wet. It's got a cavity inside so it might be holding a lot of liquid. Ooh, we're gonna let it drip a little so things don't get super messy on this dissection mat. But I think that's pretty good. We're gonna put the jar to the side, lean forward and get a better look at this bad boy. Yo, check that out. Ah, oh, that's so sick. Okay, so I kind of thought that squid moved around by just using these arms right here to push the water, you know, like opening them up and pushing the water to scoot around. But that's not the case. Instead, check out this part right here that kind of looks like a mushroom cap. This is the squid's mantle. You can see it juts out on either side at the top right here. If I turn this to the side, you can see those are kind of thin little appendages almost. These are fins. And you don't think about squids having fins, but they have two fins on the top of their mantle right there. When they want to make really small movements, They'll, they'll uh, kind of like flap or undulate those fins a little to help them scoot around almost like a fish. But if they want to move fast, they do something entirely different. I'm going to zoom in a little. Now take a close look at the bottom of the mantle. You can kind of tell there's a little bit of a slit right here, kind of like a gap or opening. So squid can suck water into their mantle through a gap down there called the aperture. And once it's inside the mantle, I'm gonna turn this around to show you another interesting thing. Ready? You see that little kind of like nub or hole right there? Let's push in on it. Yeah. Ooh, nice. Okay, this. This is called the siphon or funnel on a squid. So once they suck water through the gap in their mantle, it's holding it inside, then the squid can push it out specifically out of this siphon or funnel. It's almost like a little jet of water. It can use that little jet to shoot itself around. It's, it's quite literally jet propulsion. So squid can move around in two ways, one by undulating those fins, and two by shooting jets of water out of their siphon or funnel at the bottom. Let me know what you guys wanna see next.